hope all is well. This is Teresa M, AKA 50 plus 2013. Today I'm bringing you a video which is just an accumulative haul. Things I purchased within the last one and a half to two weeks ago. And there is a little bit of a backstory, but the main thing is after having this stuff for all this time, I'm so anxious to just to get to use this stuff. As a matter of fact, I don't really even know all that I have in here at this point because I just have it in this bag. It's just an Ikea bag, and um, which is my laundry bag. I ended up putting the items in the bag because I had it all displayed out, getting it situated for whenever I felt like filming. And I ended up having company, so I needed to put it somewhere. So into the laundry basket slash bag from Ikea it went. Now the backstory on this is I originally went to Walmart to buy a toothbrush. And the reason why is because I normally will buy a toothbrush once my toothpaste run, um, run out. So whenever I buy a toothpaste, I buy another toothbrush. But because all of this ailments and sickness and colds and flu has been going around, I was thinking to myself, once I got over my cold, let me just go ahead and change out my toothbrush. So I went to Walmart to look for a toothbrush, but I personally have to have a cute toothbrush. I have no idea why, that's just me. And I ended up stumbling up on this. This is not cute, but per se, but it was just something that I got because nothing else stood out and said buy me. So these are like toothbrushes that have caps on them already. So I thought, thought how convenient and I went ahead and got it. So yay to the toothbrush. And plus if I have company, maybe they can have um, one. If they don't bring one, they have one there. So let's see. If you're visiting for the first time, I would like to say welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. And I'm just asking all of you, once you click on the video, please watch it to the end. That helps my channel a lot. And let's get started. But besides, thumbs up, subscribe, and click the notification bell. And if you want to, please leave me a comment. I answer back all comments in some form or fashion. So let's get right into the video. All right, so this bag is gonna be crackling and making some kind of noise for you, but it's okay. I did get um, a product in this bag that is new. I never heard of it, never seen it before. So I thought I'd try it. And what it is, is a vitamin E oil, but it's like for massages, hair, well, from top to bottom, just externally, not nothing to be consumed. Um, some panty liners, which these are the cheapest, like these are cheaper at Walmart than they are at the dollar store. So that's why I get them there. I picked up this and I only got this because, well, a lot of reasons. I love it. I think it works really, really well, but I had a $3 coupon off. So was it two or $3? So I had a good coupon off, just put it that way. Cause anytime a coupon gives me more than $2 off without having to buy two of something like the conditioner and the shampoo, I feel like that's the real deal. And the next thing I got is actually for my granddaughter. And I got her this, I buy Witch Hazel, but I just buy the Walmart generic brand. But this is Dickerson's because I just wanted to get her the a name brand one. And it's a hydrating toner. And I got her some cotton rounds. But I think I'm going to keep these and get her some from the dollar store. But these are Swiffers from Walmart. And this was um, a little expensive. But the only reason why I um, went ahead and splurged on hers because I got my younger granddaughter something that... That's not in this haul, but I felt like I didn't want to give one something and not the other. Then I picked these up and I got them for free because I had buy two, get two dollars off. Wait, how does, how does it go? Well, anyway, these ended up being $1.50 and I had a good coupon where it ended up being negative. So I, I virtually got these free. They're Garnier Whole Blends and this is the Color Care Shampoo System and I just thought, I didn't even know it was $1.50 first of all. I just wanted to get it and it turned out that, yeah, it turned out that I got it for $1.50 and it smells really good. But what I'm, what I'm realizing right now is it says, both of them say shampoo. So I'm going to give one away. I picked up the uh, useful adult butt wipes okay two things that came from the the uh after christmas sale but it was like way past it so i got them for like um just 
under like 50 cent under 50 cent so here's a mr bubbles in this original bubble bath and i feel like i needed to get this anyway because my granddaughter when i put it in her stocking stuffer she never must she may never have had bubble bath because she dumped the whole thing in trying to make bubbles she didn't realize you poured in as you run the water so that's working out and i think i'll let her learn how to use bubble bath at my house because we can't be wasting money like that. It's called Rose. It's a hand wash. And it's like little pieces of roses in it. It's so cute. I just thought, wow, this is really a cute little... It, the packaging alone is cute. I don't even know what it smells like. But this was left from the ho left over from the holidays too. It smells like roses, but a good in a good way. Like a way that I like. Because I'm not a person that liked the scent of roses. That's not my personal scent of choice. I picked up zinc. Um, I guess I had um, a new physician and I went in and just to go over whatever, whatever, because my new, phys my old physician has packed up and left the building. No, her husband transferred and um, so she left to follow her husband, which I don't believe is the truth. I believe her time was up at Kaiser. So I don't know why they would make up stories why they no longer work there. But anyways, I went to go meet my new provider and not my new provider, my new physician and he suggested I go ahead and get zinc. So this is so totally unnecessary and it's the Moda Mythical brush and it's just, you can use for anything, but I like it because it's pink and it's cute. I don't know if you could see it really because I've got some light situation. Anyway, it's pink. It has like a crystal looking um, handle and this is nice and um, pink and I think it's synthetic but I have never opened this but anyways I'm the sucker for packaging I got it strictly because of the way it looked I got Lumify and this is my holy grail eye drop I cherish this I hate using it because it's not that many ounces in here this is something that I have I will and have reached out to the company for a coupon so I had a five dollar off coupon and I think this was around $11, but this is just the best eye drop. If you suffer from like red eyes like I do from allergies or dry eyes or anything like this that. This is another thing that I picked up that I didn't need actually. And it's the real tech, well maybe I did need this. Because it's for powdered makeup. And it is a Samantha Chapman, Samantha Chapman Real Techniques Powder Blending um, sponge. So the regular one for foundation. It's right here. And then she has another one for powder foundation, which I thought it was for powder, not wait, is it says powder foundation? It just says powder makeup. So your setting powder and probably powdered um powder type of foundation also. I don't know. But I'm really glad I got that. I think it's cute color. I think it's nifty idea. And I can't wait to try it. So if you're wondering what I was talking about, it's this bag here that's from Ikea. And then the last thing I got is I noticed that there's like this sample size section now. And it's not like the travel size that you see in Target or Walmart. This is like a sample size. So I picked up this Earth to Skin and it's a honey. It's a gel cream for day and night. And you got two little um, creams in here to try. And so I thought, wow, that's a nice way to try something. And I think it was $2.50 or something like that. So that's not even bad. That's that's good. I don't know what it was. I'm, I think it's more than $2.50. That just don't sound right. This And this is what it looks like. The two little jars. And then this is what they look like. And they're kind of like things you would get in a, uh, a subscription. So I feel like, hey, I can just go pick it out and handle it and see how well I like it and then buy it rather than wait. That is all that I have for this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you on my next one. Talk to you later and may God bless you all.